the noise. We got the women here too. I know. They're drinking it up. We're drinking it up. Everybody's having a good time. It's party night. But we want to talk about wrestling. So there will be times you're going to hear laughter, giggles, and snorts. That's right. My woman, she snorts when she laughs. You might hear it. Let's take a look. They're here, but we're still talking. It begins now. The pen. Bring it on down. Underrated. Should have had more. No. Underrated superstar. I'm going to go for another shot right now. Shaka special. Another Shaka special. Go with the man named Rico. Rico. Ooh. Rico Costantino? That's right. The one that was in American Gladiators? One and the only. The dude with the cyber. The American Gladiator. The cyber. Uh, the man took the gold dust giving to another level. Yeah. Adrian Street, really. It's Rico right there. He had Miss Jackie. Uh, could have yeah, Miss Jack. The man had away. the heat. Wherever he went, he had the heat. He had all the makings to be a top superstar. At least Intercontinental Champion. At least. And they just kind of dropped it. He didn't even win him. He's uh, no. No. He didn't call it East. It was kind of a, a flash in the pan. They didn't get any with him. I felt Rico could have been way, way more used, way more utilized. Rico. Rico. Underrated. Us. You know, Rico definitely did have like the look of a gimmick and you know he had like something going on there, but you know, his wrestling skills were okay, but he, I, I just feel like he wasn't as athletic as he could have been in the ring. Nevertheless, it's alright. And he didn't really, he didn't really talk about okay, no, it. No, he's not even right. He's not even reaching the grip. Okay, I'm not no, reaching. No. I understand. I like I understand where you're coming from though. You know, so. Hardcore Holly! 
ASA, the Native American, Tatanka, all right, as the most, he's not going for it. Um, I mean, most underrated. He had a streak, all right. He had the second coolest thing, the Hulk Hogan's lift off, head shake going on. He had the dance, the Indian dance. That was freaking amazing. Let's not forget the, I mean, that's, that's, that's how you start off a match. All right, and uh, he had the cool red thing, sort of like Red Rooster. A lot of people know I like Red Rooster. Tatanka represented the redhead too, maybe an ode to him, I don't know. But uh, yeah, Tatanka was cool. Oh. That's, that doesn't make any sense. It makes full sense. Tatanka is cool because he represented Red Rooster. And he did not represent Red Rooster. He had nothing to do with Red Rooster. I might have stumbled my words, but I had to jumble. Yes, yes, but maybe Red Rooster was an he might have been. No, he was not. Well, the rooster no, might have been not. Indian. He, he was not. Well, <laughs> it's getting ridiculous. But he's not throwing the pen based on Tatanka. He's throwing the pen based on the red head. That's true. But I'm saying, when you have a red head, you're going to win Survivor Series. And Tatanka won all of the Survivor Series matches. Very weird. Pick up the thing. Red head, you win Survivor Series. Tatanka, the most underrated. We just watched the, the other night, Red Rooster That's lost. when he was a bad guy. We did watch one Survivor Series, Red Rooster was a bad guy, and he lost. That's because he was a villain, he was going up against Hulk Hogan's team. Who's going to win that? But when he was a good guy, and he had the Rooster Boosters, I don't know if you guys know that, Wikipedia, if you were a fan of Red Rooster, you became a Rooster Booster. Right? You did not. Please wiki that. that. Wiki that. Wiki that, and then write me back. Write me back. So, Tatanka, Rico, you can say it. Hardcore Holly. Hardcore Holly. Yes. Okay. And what has transpired as far as his career is concerned. But at the same time, he's accepted what he did not kill, and that can't be forgotten. Very cool.